So going into fall seven, I found out a good piece of information. I found out that today at the traveling cart, there will be a Nautilus shell and a crocus, which are two things I need to complete the community center. The Nautilus shell I was very worried about, actually. I completely forgot that I, that I would need a Nautilus shell and that's winter only, but I can get it from the traveling cart. So I know that it's going to be best luck and I do want to go get more iridium for sprinklers, but traveling cart first. Um, the crab pots I might wait on, the the Mackie roll, I might not just upgrade the house, we'll have to see, but um, yeah, let's jump into the game, I forgot to load it, but yeah, so traveling cart is definitely on the agenda, um, let me move my game over to this screen, traveling cart is definitely on the agenda, and um, if, hopefully we'll still have time to do a little bit of uh, skull caverns, I don't need a lot of iridium, like I don't have a lot left of a lot, a lot of iridium left that I need, need in the short term anyways. I will obviously need lots of iridium long term. Here we go. Uh, so the weather for Monday is rain. It is best luck. And we just learned how to make tortillas. Excellent. Okay, so let's grab, how's my inventory looking? Inventory is looking good. Let me grab my milking pail. We got some crops there to grab as well. We got, uh, whatchamacallit? Oak resin. Hopefully the duck will give us a duck feather today. Goat has no milk. Let me go get the, uh, the milk from the cow first. Now quickly let me pet these animals before they run away. There we go. Duck feather? So good. So, so good. Oh my goodness. It's just, it's just so good. Beautiful. Just beautiful. We have a duck feather. I mean, honestly, I think I might pull, I think, I mean, I got lucky, don't get me wrong. Like I completely forgot about the things I actually need to not forget about. But, um, in all honesty, I might be able to pull the community center off um, pretty soon. Because what do I have now? So the fall crop touching to pumpkin. That's going to be ready in a few days. That will get me the greenhouse. The craft room. I'm going to pick up a crocus today. All I'm going to need is a snow yam, which I hopefully will get from my winter seeds once I get those winter seeds planted in, in the greenhouse. Specialty fish. Must remember to get those. And I also need a walleye. Hmm. Get fish. Um, bulletin board. Mackie roll. So the diet, that's going to be done. That's going to be done. Ooh, pomegranate though. Dang. Okay, let's go to the let's go to the traveling cart right now. Let's make sure I don't don't forget any of this stuff. Maybe in the winter I'll rejig my farm, but hopefully by winter I'll have access to Ginger Island and I can just, I might just move all my thing, everything to Ginger Island. We will have to see. Yeah, I'm not sure how I'm gonna deal with that. Oh my God, the duck feather, that's so awesome. Man alive. All right, give me that Nautilus shell. I'm spending the money, give me that crocus just to have a guarantee. Um. Oh, anything else? New. No. Okay. It's a new week. Maybe I'll go give the Wizard of Void Essence right now. While I am here. Ugh, things are, things are starting to really... <laughs> things are starting to, like, I mean, knock on wood, but things are actually... I'm starting to feel pretty good about things. Uh, give me a second here. I have way too many windows open. There we go. Alright. Alright, Wiz. Have a Void Essence. If I'm going into town, I guess I should probably... What's up, Andrew Hansel? I wonder how many people stare right at the injection site as they're about to get it. Typically me. Well, I, actually, I don't know. I, shots don't really bother me. Oh, but good news! I get my first COVID-19 shot on Saturday. Super excited about that. 
pretty stoked. I had literally just crawled into bed and uh, on a whim, I saw my phone light up. I'm like, why is my phone lighting up? Why, what kind of message am I getting? It was an email. It was like, I don't know, it was probably like quarter to midnight last night. I got the email saying, hey, you can, uh, you can sign up. You can sign up to get your vaccine. So I'm pretty stoked about that. Pretty stoked. Got my shower time back. Nice. Yeah, I'm pretty jazzed about that. I'm pretty excited. <sighs> Goodness. Twelve. All right. So I need to put two beets in here for recipes. I need to make sure I ship a beet. gold one. And I need to put 10 in... Why do I have so many beats? I need to put 10 in what's this in thing, so that's, that's going to leave me two more. Okay, I'll just put them in the kitchen for now. I'm going to pick up some more pumpkin seeds as well, just to grab them. Uh, I only need to have 10 on me. There's 10. Beautiful. Been dealing with a foot injury since before. Oh, really? That's, sorry to hear that. Oh, is it getting better? Like, I, <laughs> I can relate to having nagging injuries. Uh, okay, so what am I doing? What am I doing? Let me get rid of, didn't do this very well. Let's put the milky pail in there. Let me go back to the coop because I have an egg on me for some reason, which I guess I'll just pop it in there. Okay. Um, pet the dog. All right, so I need some community center. So community center, community center, uh, Lewis, Lewis. Um, okay, put those in there. Both tools healed of splits, though still a little sore. Oof. Well, I'm glad you're I'm glad there's leather on the mend. I'm glad you're on the mend. Yeah, I. <laughs> I was thinking today as I was running on the spot, because I've started running on the spot for a few minutes every day before I have lunch. That, um, why do I have these five gold bars on me? I'm not sure. So yeah, I was thinking today that, uh, about how injury prone, how injury prone I am. I'm not accident prone, I'm not clumsy. I'm just, you know, softer than a wet bag of noodles, so I am, uh, I just really, I hurt. Um, I guess we'll take some cheese for a thing, and then take one of those, and take one of those. I'm going to keep one of these on me as well. I can go give it to Sandy if I make it over there. What else do I have to do today? So we bought those. We're going to deliver those. Crab pot. Maybe I will check Gus and... Crab pots can wait. I'm not going to do crab pots today. So let's go fall eight, move crab pots to river pond. I just put pog. Um, so we do want to check Gus for a Mackie roll. Oh, oh. We might just have to upgrade the house. Although there's no point in me upgrading the house until... Actually, yeah, there's no point in me upgrading the house until I'm, like, for a Mackie roll, that's not worth doing. So I'll have that done. Because that one I'm not going to have for se until seven days after I get, or six or seven days after I get the greenhouse, because I can use speed grow. The walleye I should be able to get whenever. The specialty fish I could probably get whenever. Mackie roll's all I need there. Duck feather I've got. Nautilus shell I've got. Pomegranate. Pomegranate. Pomegranate might be a problem. Can I get a pomegranate from the traveling cart anytime soon? Glad I got diminished sensation in both feet, but both injuries were on the more sensitive right foot. Oof. Not till year three. Did I miss it by any chance? No, I didn't. Okay. So, yeah, the pomegranate might be what kills me. So, I'm not going to need that right now. 
Uh, Alright, so gift, 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 gift. That's probably fine. Any quests I need to do? Marnie wants amaranth. The amaranth isn't done. I do need to grab some pumpkin seeds. I will grab some pumpkin seeds. Um, yeah, anyways, I, I find myself to be very... Um, I'm very injury prone. Because I'm a computer geek by trade, so I sit on my butt all day not moving, and then I sit on my butt all evening not moving. So I have found that... Uh, a little bit of even a little bit of exercise like running on the spot for five minutes a day a beat I've got beats where's Alex it's right there let's give Alex a beat Yeah, just that little bit of exercise makes such a huge difference for me. Um, just finished a round of Among Us? Nice. Man, I gotta play Among Us. I haven't played Among Us in a while. My eyesight may be poor, but my nose hasn't failed me yet. I can smell fallen leaves and mushrooms. It reminds me of the forest I used to play in as a girl. Sorry, I just hit you with a hammer. Cookies, thank you. Rounds go fast. Yeah, they really do. Let me buy some pumpkins. I'm not sure how many to buy. Let's just buy like 30 or 40 or something. That'll be more than enough for now. We're going to give George. Um, what are we giving George? We're gonna give George this cheese. Talk with Jody while I'm here. Yeah, I do, uh, I was hoping, I, mean, I know the last time I played Among Us, I was playing with Rainbow Panda, I was really hoping that we were going to be, uh, imposters together, because that would have been fun, but. Uh, okay, so I need one more beat. Um, and I have to, let me swing by the community center right now before I forget. Swing by the community center, drop off, um, stuff. It's so good. Things are going super good. Okay, so not that one. Yes, this one. Bam. What's that? Seed maker. Sweet. That's useful. Field research. Bam. What's this? Recycling bin. Nice. Tensure bundle. No bam. All right, so I do have a crocus. Probably a waste of money. But like I say, it's one less thing to worry about when I get the... Uh, when I get those winter seeds planted. I just need one snowy amp. Winter foraging. Bam! Sweet. Okay, so I gotta head back to the house, grab another beat. Um, we're super close with these bundles, though. Super close with the bundles. Hocus Crocus. Alright, so back to the house. Grab a beat. Then we're gonna go find Lewis. We'll give him the hot pepper. We're gonna put the ten beats in the... I'm not even reading what these dialogues are. I'm just trying to make sure I talk with people. Um, put the 10 beats in this fridge. I can't remember if there's another thing we have to do. Just saw Abigail there. She'll probably come this way. I can't remember if there's another thing I have to do. Um, is there another thing I have to do with the... Where did I put the beats? Are they inside? Where did I put the beats? I'm just put him in the house. I can't remember if there's nothing I have to do before I put the um, before I put the solar essence in the dude in the desert. So I'll take the solar essence with me as well. So that's for the desert. That's for the desert. Um, maybe I'll just plant these crops while I'm here. Actually, let's get some stuff planted. There we go. It's gonna make a bit of a mess for um, when things finish, but whatever. All right, let's go find Lewis. Q. 
Can I, once I've done that, can I go to right to the desert? I probably can, to be honest. So maybe I'll leave a few more things behind and I'll grab a desert totem. And yeah, put those guys there. Don't need them. I mean, the gold is like whatever. Um, I can eat that, eat that. Eat those if I need to. Oh, I should leave these behind, actually. Eat, I got cave carrots. I'll, I'll, oh. So I have 10 cave carrots and a blackberry and a cookie. That's not a lot of food. I guess, well, I could swing by, I could swing by the saloon and buy some salads. I think salads are probably the best kind of money to energy ratio. So maybe I'll do that. But let's go find Lewis here. Eat gold better than lead. All right. What up, Gus? Mackie roll? Oh, calamari. Sad. Uh, okay, so let me just buy, like, oof. Spent a couple of grand on salads. Yike. Ugh. Hate to do it, I really want the money for other stuff, but. Alright, is Lewis at his house? No, but let me put the 10 beats in while I'm here, anyways. Give the sand dragon his last meal. Sweet, so that is the last thing I have to do. Alright, so we're gonna get the. Uh, the she card here. Uh, let me just see where Lewis is so I'm not wandering around for no reason. So it is Sunday the 7th of fall. Fall on a Sunday. Uh, stands by the river near Leah's cabin. But he should be walking. He should be on the way, on the way back right now. I'm going to give him this. Apparently he's on his way back from Leah's cabin right now. Talk with Emily. Check garbage. Ooh, nice. Fish can eat that. Where is Lewis? I wonder. Oh, wait, did it say? No, at four he walks from the river to Mayor's Manor. Okay, so he should be right here somewhere. We'll grab this mushroom while I'm at it, too, actually. There he is. Hot pepper for you. All right, I'm not going to go home. I'm going to ignore. The, the mushroom. Let's quickly pop over here. It's 4 p.m. I'm not super hopeful I'm going to get a lot of uh, good things, but work from Monday to Saturday, fall, fall on Sunday. Don't eat the mushroom. Let's go inside, talk with Sandy. Uh, and give Sandy this guy. There you are, my dear. I'm not buying anything from her, am I? No. Okay. So we are then going to give the Sand Dragon his last meal. And then we will head into the mine, for what it's worth. I'm not going to be able to do too much, obviously, but... Check the pile of lumber next to your house. Okay, gotta, gotta remember to do that. I will forget. Did I bring my fishing rod with me? Dang it! I brought my fishing rod with me. Forgot, I need to get those. Need to get those. Those fish. How many do I have? I've got eleven. Let's do like artifact trove. One more warp. warp. Oh, two more warp totems. Okay. So I'm gonna go home. Grab my fishing rod. Can I leave anything here? Salads. Leave the cactus fruit there too, I guess. Although, I, how many cactus fruit do I need at home? I actually don't know. But if I am going into the... Uh, it's 5 p.m. Do I even bother? I don't even know. Again, another wasted best luck day. But I need... I mean... This, if, if anything's going to sink this run, it's going to be this. Where I gotta, like, get caught up to... Oh, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do this. Oh, now we got to do this, got to do this. Instead of just saying, you know what? Screw everything. It's best luck. 6, 10 a.m. Get to the mine. And now I'm going all the way home. 
to get a fishing rod because I forgot my fishing rod. And now I've wasted an entire best luck day spinning my tires. Weak. All right, so we've got some artifact troves. We have a sardine now, for what that's worth. Coconuts, uh, I'll leave one of those there. I guess I can leave this mushroom here too. Need a bunch of those. Uh, all right, so let's now try and get a sandfish. At least I have 91 bait, so that's good news. I want to get these artifact spots too. I'm pretty sure there are artifacts you can get here that you can't get anywhere else. I think that is the case. Alright, uh, fish. Give me a sandfish. Ooh, I want that treasure chest though. Ooh, oh my goodness, all over the place. Nice. What did I get in the chest? Geode. Alright, we'll take that. You know what? Actually, it's best luck. How do I get a walleye? Maybe I should just bang these fish out right now. Oh, it's gonna be raining, so I get it tomorrow, I guess. Between noon and 12 a.m. Near noon and 2 a.m., okay. Uh, well, what else do I need for that? Ghost fish. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do? Yeah, I'm just gonna go home. Um, <laughs> hate to do it. Hate to waste the best luck day, but I also need to catch a lava eel and stonefish, and it's best luck. So maybe I'll try and get those guys. I wasted two. Um, desert totems today, but whatever. There will hopefully be other days. All right, so I think we gotta go to level twenty, and we gotta cast out here. I should be able to catch a stonefish, hopefully. And then I think ghostfish is level forty, and I think lava eel is like level eighty or a hundred or something. I should double check. Uh, stonefish is level twenty. Uh, ghostfish is underground lakes in the mine, so probably anywhere, I guess. Oh, oh, twentieth and sixtieth floor during all seasons. Okay, so twenty. So here I can get a ghostfish here as well. Lava eel level one hundred. Uh, second most difficult fish. May not be able to catch one. Um, what other fish do I need to catch right now? Uh, where does it say location? Mine, so ghost fish, stone fish, ice pip, level 60. So basically we'll fish at level 20 till I get a stone fish, then we'll go to level 60, try and get a ghost fish and an ice pip. And then we'll try and get the lava eel at level 100, and that I think will be it. Although maybe I should do the lava eel first. Well, I don't know. Maybe I should... I, I don't know. It doesn't matter. They all need to get caught, so whatever. Let's try and catch them. I don't know if I need to even cast this far, or like... No idea. Getting lots of stuff I don't need. <clears throat> I think a stonefish is actually pretty rare, though, I want to say. I think it's not super common. So I would imagine that's going to be a lot of not catching it for a while. But anyways. Now we wait. It's 7 p.m. 8 p.m. Oh, I'm getting lots of trash, which I mean, I'll be able to convert into useful stuff. But, uh. <clears throat> yeah. So, yeah, working on my Stardew 
perfection tracking or item tracking website. A um, lot of brain thinking going into how to organize things. Like I said, I think I have it nailed down now. I think I'm, I think I'm pretty good. But uh, so I was hoping to catch more than like a fish tonight. At this point, I'm gonna be just hoping to catch a fish tonight. Like I haven't had a single bite, really. Whoops. Panicked. Like not even a bite? Not even a bite with like a crazy difficult catch? I mean, I guess I can't complain. Like all this green algae and stuff I can use for skull, skull, food. Skull. I keep hearing bubbles and then I might turn my volume up a little bit. Oh my goodness, I did it again. Um, yeah, I can use for food for my next skull cavern run. I really need to get some more jades. See, the other thing is, I really need to get some crystallariums going. Because I was kind of going to be relying on those for, like, gifts. So, I kind of need crystallariums, which needs iridium. Uh, which is a problem. <laughs> so, we'll see, I guess. Let's remember to not eat the sandfish. Well, I mean, I've been here for a while. There we go. Hopefully this is a stonefish. I'm just going to go straight to level 100 and try for the lava eel. Stonefish? It was a ghostfish. Okay, I'm not mad at it. I did need a ghostfish. Hoping to catch a ghostfish on level 60. I would have preferred if that was a stonefish. That's okay. Hopefully. Hmm. Actually, now that I think about it, how many casts did I get before I got a bite? Okay, here we go. What is this? Please be a stonefish. I want this chest as well. Yes! There we go. Got all those fossils. Sweet. Alright, let's eat. Uh... Um, I probably don't need to eat that one. Let's eat the... maybe the cookies. Save the cactus fruit. It's worth a lot more. Let's go to 100. Let's try and catch me a lava eel. Not that it matters, I guess. Because really, I could catch one... I need to catch one. I don't need it for anything other than... to catch all the fish. So... I guess technically I wouldn't have needed to catch this today. I mean, the ghost fish I do need. Um, oh, is this it? Come on, best luck. Come on, best luck. Baby, got him. Sweet. Can I catch a quick ice pip? That I'd never have to fish these mines again? Okay, I mean, it would be good to be, uh, hmm. I should probably leave, actually. It would be good to swing by the community center before... I'm not going to have time, though. Yeah, I'm not convinced I would have time. To swing by the community center and then make it home? Yeah, probably not. That'd be, oh, sorry, hit the microphone. That'd be a little risky. Part of me is kind of tempted to pass out in the mines, but like I say, I have the rest of my two-year run to to catch this, so let's leave it at that. Let's head back to the house. I really need a glow ring. I don't have a glow ring yet, it's quite sad. Okay, let's sell some stuff, including this stuff. Sell the pickled corn, the blackberry jelly, and the salmonberry jelly. Sell the Nautilus fossil. Um, and that's it. Everything else I want to keep for food. The lava eel. Uh, do I need a lava eel for anything? Let me have a look. Lava eel. I don't, do I need it for like a recipe or anything? No. So I can sell the lava eel. What about the stonefish? 
Spelled stone wrong. Stonefish. I uh, don't see anything. No quests, no recipes, nothing. So that can get sold as well. The ghost fish and the sandfish, I need to complete that bundle. And everything else is pretty much either food or garbage. Uh, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to grab my other um, recycler. And we're going to drop the, put the recycler down. We'll put two things in the recyclers. And I'll go to bed. Okay, so I mean, it wasn't a great day, but I mean, we got a lot of important things done. <laughs> so I can't get played. Ooh, artisan. Or do I want agriculturalist? Do I want the money or do I want crops faster? Money. <laughs> yep. And let's just not even think about it. Let's do the money. Okay, sweet. That means I hit level 10 farming. That's awesome. That is fantastic. That's very exciting stuff. Okay. Hey, Lil done. It is raining today, so I can get you a walleye. It's going to rain tomorrow as well. And it's good luck, so it's kind of tempting to do another skull cavern. It's tempting to, to tr attempt a skull cavern run. Ooh, and we got cranberries now. And the amaranth is done. Let me grab some more pumpkin seeds uh, from somewhere from here and let me grab my scythe animals are going to be stuck in the in the uh, barn so I don't need to worry about chasing them down grab you plant you how many cranberry seeds do I need or how many cranberries in general I need um, five cranberries how many do I have five cranberries baby let's go five nice so we've got that we've got the oh no oh no we're good okay Whew. uh so we've need, i need five cranberries i'm gonna mark that as being green i'm gonna ship one because i'm sure that i need one to ship i'm also going to ship an amaranth uh, how many amaranth do i need i mean it must just be the one right amaranth must be ship one one for marnie for that quest and one for a recipe uh, quest, recipe, yeah, sweet. So I'll leave one in there for the recipe. Uh, how many cactus fruit do I need for recipes? I should look, check that out as well. Pretty sure I need a cactus fruit for something. There must be. Cactus fruit. We need... Oh, just ten for a desert obelisk. I say just ten. I mean, ten's a lot of cactus fruit. Okay, so we got potato, we got potatoes, pumpkins in. Uh, Linus wants a blackberry. Well, he needs his basket. Okay, that I can do. Uh, I should ship some stuff while I'm here. So let's ship a cranberry and a gold quality amaranth. Have I shipped a cactus fruit? Yes, I have. Okay. Can I ship the pale ale? Have I shipped a black? I must have, I, sh I must have shipped a blackberry by now, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, sweet. All right. Let's put some more trash in the recyclers. We've got some uh, little torches, which can go in he here, I guess. We've got some more of that. Pick up this wet truffle. I mean, who knows? There might be like other truffles that are like hiding around somewhere that I have no idea where they are. Uh, all right, so oh, I didn't bring the milking pail. All right, let's swing in here. All right, let's drop an egg in the mayo machine. Got there. I really need to get an auto grabber actually um, in this barn. So I really need. Uh, all right. Uh, well, let's grab the milking pail, and then then we will check the fruit cave as well. Nothing really to check for in the fruit cave except for gifting stuff. Really, I don't think I need any fruit for anything else. Possibly. I'm actually, not sure. I'm not entirely sure. 
All right, we've got a couple milks. Ooh, some large milks. All right. Uh, quick check in the cave. We've got some blackberries on the go now. Apricot. Someone loves apricot. Let me keep the apricot handy. I want to say it's... Is it Jody or... Somebody loves apricot anyways. Any other garbage I have? Yes. We do have a couple more garbages. That gave us some um, much more columns. That can go in there. Uh, I'm going to put the apricot... How many apricots do I need? Let me have a look. The uh, here. I need one for a fruit salad, probably one to ship, and one for Emily. So I should probably hang on to all these. I don't think I've shipped one yet, have I? So whatever, wherever it is, it'll be tiny. Yeah, it's probably right there. All right, so we're gonna put one in there. It'll probably be a while before I have that recipe, but we're gonna hang on to that anyways. Um, okay. Let's put the milking pail away, and the scythe, and I'm going to drop off uh, the geode somewhere. Where do geodes go? Oh, they must be the same chest. Must be this chest. That's where they should go anyways. Um, so, let's get organized here. Let's get, let's get organized, hmm? Oh, I did see a honey in here. And I'm trying to find a, find my maple syrup. There they are. Uh, I could do gifting today. I think I'm going to hold off. I'm going to leave the amaranth in there as well. Or maybe I just... Do I just do it? I don't know. I could just do it. Uh, let's sell the truffle. Um, so food, food, food. So that's community center. That's community center. I don't need to go to the community center today. Uh, let's sell the mayonnaise. Um, everything else is pretty much food. Let me just put the pumpkin seeds away. We'll go give Marnie her amaranth. Where do the seeds go? Here they are. Uh, we'll give Marnie her amaranth, and I will do the rest of my gifting, I guess. So we'll give... Take something for Sandy. And we'll go back to the desert. Grab that, grab that. Grab a cheese for George. Try and catch Leah. Is Leah going to be out and about right now? Am I going to be able to catch her easily? Oops. Can't type right now. Uh, it is fall. Rainy day. She goes to the star drop. I don't think I'm good enough friends with her to get inside her house, though, am I? Leah. Two hearts. Is it enough? Because she loves goat cheese, right? She does. Maybe I give her... Maybe I'll take... I'm gonna, let, me, let, me, let me try. Let me try. I do like me some Leah. Let's try and give Leah some goat cheese. Uh, and then let me grab a Void Essence. Alright. So we're going to... Give... Wait... It's Monday. Marnie isn't at home on a Monday. Fall 18, we were 16. Raining slash Thursday. At home. Oh, she is at home. No, it's Thursday, though. Monday. She's at Pierre's. So maybe... Okay, well, we'll gift the wizard. Get that over with this week. <clears throat> we'll try and gift Leah. Hopefully I can get into her house. Um, we will... Uh, and we'll swing by town. Gift Evelyn, gift George, gift... Uh, Mar give Marnie the Amaranth. That is what I need to give her, right? Yeah. Um, oh, there's a mushroom over there, too. I need to grab that. Again, wasting time that I could be spending in the Skull Caverns. Um... And yeah, then we will...
didn't bring a, a warp totem with me, so we'll just go to the bus. Alright, so that's the wizard for this week. I'm going to take the south side of the lake this time, in case I can get some more forage stuff. I still have to get my foraging up. Because what's one of my levels right now? It's great that I hit level 10 farming, that's awesome. Level 7 foraging. Oh wait, my level 7, level 6 combat. I mean, I'll get there, but... I mean, by the time you've, um... By the time you have all the Monster Slayer goals, I mean... I would imagine by then... I just realized I do not have my animation cancelling turned on. I'd imagine by the time you finish all the Monster Slayer goals, you'll probably be level 10 combat. Alright, Leah, let me in. Let me in the house. Yes! Ooh, cutscene. Oh, hi, Paul. Come in, come in. Thanks, Leah. Just working on this sculpture here. Looks great. Come here, watch this. Okay. See that? I'm revealing the essence of the wood. Once you get past the outer layers, the true nature starts to show. Um, what do I need to hit here to make this work? Leah, cutscenes, cutscenes, cutscenes. I want to make sure I max out the uh, no effect, no effect. So, any, so as long as I don't say um, as long as I don't say may I have a kiss. It's the same with people. What? Oh yeah, I guess that's absolutely right. I first visited this valley as a little girl while on vacation with my parents. I knew I had to come back someday. This place has some great this place has great artistic potential. Fingers crossed. Although I have to admit, it's not easy to pay the bills as an artist. Um doesn't matter. I'm gonna say, why don't you have an art show in town? Hmm, interesting. I guess that I could see that the wheels motion to, in motion to make Pelican Town a true art destination. But what if no one likes my sculptures? I'd be crushed. I'll have to think about it. Well, thanks for stopping by, Paul. No worries, Leah. While I'm here, have a go, cheese. What if I said the internet? She knows that she would need a computer for that, but they're expensive. She doesn't think about it. Okay. All right. So we gotta give, gotta find Marnie, Lewis. You know what I forgot to do? I forgot to. Uh, oh, I should have something for Vincent too, actually. I forgot, as I predicted I would, to uh, get the casino card from the log pile by my house. So, Linus wants community cleanup. Pierre wants 25 gold star vegetables. So, I like the idea of doing the gold star vegetables. However, that's a lot of money right now. I need the money. Linus wants 20. He gives me the fiber seeds recipe. That is important. I need that. And the gold star vegetables only gives me a shipping bin. We're going with the fishing. 20 trash items. All right. Is the mayor at home? Yes. Sweet. Garbage can. Uh, let's swing by Gus as well. There we go. Uh, he isn't at the bar yet, so we'll come back. Let me give these gifts first. Going to gift Evelyn and George. Talk to Alex. Give Evelyn the flower. How am I doing? Nine. Sweet. We're so close with Evelyn. Oh my goodness, we're so close. And with we're getting there with George, too. This is good. This is real, 
real good. Real good. Okay, uh, so that's that. What else was I going to do today? Oh, check us for a Mackie roll. I got the fish I needed, I think, except for an ice pip. Uh, let's check Gus. See if Gus happens to have a Mackie roll. Did I, do I have the fish on me? I don't. I should have brought them with me, actually. Lucky launch. Although, plus three... Uh, how long does Lucky Lunch last? Because honestly, plus three luck? It lasts um, 11 minutes, 11 seconds. That's like half a day. Um, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. That's going to make a huge difference in the Skull Caverns. Maybe I'll get like... Six more coffee or something too. I think I still have three at the in the desert. Okay, uh, I need to give Marnie the amaranth. She should be in Pierre's right now. Duh, she isn't. But let's just talk with everybody while we're here. What up, Abigail? And what up, Pierre? So where do you suppose Marnie is right now? Marnie, it is a Monday in fall. She, so she's on her way back to her house. I just missed her. <laughs> Crap. Marnie? Must have just missed her. Wait. Arrives at home and stands in the kitchen. Yep, just missed her. Just missed her while I was talking with everybody else. That's okay. That, that, that lucky lunch, though, I think what I might do is, um, if I get a best luck day... Sorry. There we go. That's done. Uh, inspect the lumber pile, finalize... Maybe I'll do that, actually. Um, although, with good luck, though, how, how am I going to get a bunch of garbage for fishing if it's good luck? I mean, the mines. I could try and get an ice pip. That might do it. Do I have to get it? Do I have to get the garbage from anywhere? No, it just has trash. Maybe I'll try that. Maybe I'll get an ice pip. What up, Sammy? Thanks for the lurk. I just spilled water all over myself. Okay. <clears throat> so. Let's do this. Let's put this in there. How are you? Oh, I'm not doing too bad. Not doing too bad. How are you doing, Sammy? What's up, what's new with you? More to the point. Uh, how much white algae do I need, by the way? I need two for a pale broth. Probably one to ship. I probably shipped one already. If I need to ship one. I may not even need to ship one. How many do I have? Nine? <laughs> okay, so let's do this. Let's ship one anyways. It's tired, staying super busy like always. Hopefully moving this summer out of my parents. Oh, nice! Sweet deal. That was a long time coming. That's good. I'm glad that's coming together for you. Do you know... Oh, I have one already. Do you know, like... Do you have a place lined up and everything? Like, are you, like... Kind of one foot out the door? Or is it just kind of still in the planning stages. Right, so, what else am I going to do today? I was just going to do all these quests, I think. Blackberry basket, that's what I was going to do. Oh, expect, inspect the lumber pile. Boop. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Finally remember to do that. Uh, okay, so... The not good enough friends with Marnie yet, I don't think. Only two hearts. Alright, so we'll do the Mare Shorts eventually. Apparently, if you put a staircase... If you have a staircase, and you put it in your pants spot here, 
they become the mare's purple shorts, apparently. Uh, I've seen it done. haven't tried it myself, but I have seen it done. So, I might do that at some point. Still planning stages. We have a place we like. And email them to get more info and see if it's still available for rent. But yeah, still planning. Sweet. That is a, a sweet deal. Congratulations. I know it's been a long time coming, so that's that's uh, that's really cool. Give this basket to Linus right now. Kind of a waste of time. But just to make sure... I don't know. Probably a waste of time. Because what do I need to do with the stuff when I'm done? Behind the train platform. It's a total waste of time. There we go. Alright. Okay, does that give me a bit of friendship with Linus now? Is he going to be less of a dick? Oh, we got two hearts. Okay. Sweet. Alright, let's try and get some garbage on this good luck day. <laughs> Go to level 60. Uh, I really want to move out. My dad still doesn't believe I'm moving, especially now since I told him it's out of state. Really? So, wait a second. When you say that we have a place we like, who's we? Go on. Well, we need that story first, then we can discuss every, discuss everything else. Oh, I got a bite. <laughs> I'm sad I got to get a nice pip. Honestly, I got so much trash at level 20. If I do get the ice pip, I might just go to level 20. I did get a lot of trash up there. Me and some streamer friends that I'm really close with. Oh, nice. Sweet. Well, that's that'll be sweet. You guys can have like a, a streamer house. Um, in which state? Thank like you. Which, which? I'm trying to think of, about my U.S. geography. I'm a little bit rusty, but that's what we're calling it. Nice. Okay, yeah, this cold getting garbage thing is not working. I'm guessing that was nice, Pip. In Texas? Wow. Sweet. Well, that'll be cool. That'll be fun. Hopefully it's somewhere nice. I hear Austin's nice. I also hear Austin's fairly cheap. Which is always a plus. And there is a raid from Piano Addict. Thank you very much for the raid, Piano Addict. Wait, Piano Addict? I know who Piano Addict is. I know who Piano Addict is because I know about the clay strap. So, I know who Piano Addict is. It's going good. How are you doing? And I know about the clay strap because I was watching um, of, uh, uh, one of Tushi's VODs and uh, where you were in Tushi's chat talking about the clay strap. Uh, what's up, Ava Plays? How you doing? Blade is here. Love the clay. Blade, the uh, Stardew developer, hacker, extraordinaire Stardew programming god. I am also familiar with Blade's work. Thank you for your service, sir. Salute. How are y'all doing? Well, I'll tell you, this is going to be... Uh, and thank you for the follow, Piano Wedding. This is going to be... Um, that's, the, yeah, that's the official title. Yes, thank you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and thank you, Blade, for the follow. Uh, yeah, this is definitely... I'm no... Blade or Piano Wedding or Tushi, I'll tell you that. Embarrassingly, this is... Um, I kind of wet the bed in, uh... Thank you, Bard Tape, for the pop, for the follow. Kind of wet the bed in the first spring. How the challenge running going? Let's see what people are doing this. Yes, well, um, the first spring was a bit of a disaster. Um, I kind of just made all the wrong decisions and forgot some stuff and whatever. But things are, are coming together. I'm hoping to have the community center done uh, on the 11th, I believe, of fall. 11th or 12th, whenever the pumpkin with speed grow is done. Um, that, or sorry, not the community, the greenhouse. Hoping to have the greenhouse done then. And then, um, I'm hoping to have the community center done 
I if okay, so basically my plan is I need a Mackie roll. I haven't upgraded my house yet. So um I can't make one. I don't really want to spend the money to upgrade it, because as you can see I'm broke. Um thank you, Fear of the Deep for the follow. Does it say deep or does it say what does that say? I can't even I need to pay attention to the fish. There we go. Um Yes, fear of deer, fear of the deer. Thank you, fear of the deer for the follow. So, yeah, I'm hope. So I should have the. I will have the greenhouse done here in a few days. So I'm hoping that I'll I'll have access to it on the, like say the 12th. Hopefully by then I'll have enough iridium, which I don't right now, um, to make the six sprinklers to cover the greenhouse. I have some winter seeds that I'm hoping to plant in the greenhouse. Um, to be able to get the winter forgeable that I need. I don't think I only need a snow yam or something. So I'm hoping to get that done and in there right away. Um, and if I can get... And thank you, Eva Plates, for the, uh, for the fall. If I can get... Have you finished the vault bundle? Yes, I have, yeah. Um, I'll actually just show you guys what I've done so far. So here's where I'm at. So pantry, I just need a pumpkin. That'll be... That's what I'm waiting for for the greenhouse. That'll be done here in a couple days. Uh, craft room, I just need a snow yam. I do have some winter seeds that I've traded for and blah, blah, blah. Uh, so those are going to go in the greenhouse with some speed grow. Hopefully that will be done soon. Fish tank, just need a walleye. Crap, it's raining today. I meant to get a walleye. Um, I have those fish already. I might actually go get a walleye, try for a walleye right now. Bulletin board, the Mackey roll. Don't have a, uh, a kitchen yet, but um, if I can't buy it from... Gus, then who oh no. knew? <laughs> then I'm going to be upgrading the uh, kitchen in the, probably the next four or five days. Uh, pomegranate. Pomegranate's a problem. Use a legendary fish for that? Wait, for you can do what now? Are you saying for you can use a legendary fish somewhere? And like in here or something? Is that, is that what I'm hearing you say? Am I, am I hearing? Did dust my ears deceive me? Uh, and that's it. That's all I need. So I'm like, I'm super close. Get it in the mail from Linus. Fascinating. Uh, yeah. Uh, so you say you don't know your geography, so you know where Texas is. Funny you say that. The house we're looking at is in Austin, Texas. Nice. Um, so yeah, the only thing, I mean, honestly, my only contribution, hey, bread, my only contribution, you have the mushroom cave then? No, I have the fruit cave. All fruit. I'm team fruit cave all the time. Macaroon in the mail from Linus if high friendship. About that. I think I just hit level two with Linus, so that's not going to happen. I mean, if I have to upgrade the house, I got to upgrade the house. That's not a problem. The only uh, sort of slight conch feels pomegranate. <laughs> feels pomegranate, man. Macaroon for the flex. The only contribution that I'm making to the world of Stardew that is probably not even going to be a contribution at all because of the way it's going to be super janky is this. It's broken right now, but um, what this is going to be when I'm done while it's from the river. Good point. Thank you. What I'm what it's going to look like when I'm done is um, let me just show you something interesting here. Let's show you uh, this. Nope. This. Nope. This. Yep. This. What I'm doing is I'm setting up... So what I've been doing to keep track of everything I need for perfection is... So for example, this is my spreadsheet for fall. This shows me everything I need to have. So for example, to complete perfection, I need four artichokes. You just, you gotta have four artichokes to complete perfection. So, um, once I have four four artichokes, then I know I have four artichokes, right? So that, that, and I only need four artichokes. You don't need any more than that to get to perfection. So I've been tr keeping track of everything in the spreadsheet, crops, fish, forage, whatever else. Um, the problem is that I never know if I've actually updated it properly or not. So. Do I actually need five cranberries? Or have I already shipped one and I only need four? Right? So I spent a lot of time in this run going, okay, it says 16. Do I need 16? Have I shipped one already? Because if I shipped one, I don't need 16. And then what do I need the other one? And I need one for this. And it's a whole thing. So what I'm essentially doing is I'm going to... I tried to set up like a fancy spreadsheet to keep track of everything. 
but I was doing it in Google Sheets. It wasn't as powerful as I would have liked. So I'm actually doing it in a database. So what I'm going to have is like a web page that's going to do the math and stuff for me. So all I'm going to do is there'll be a checkbox that says summer foraging bundle. I hit that checkbox and it says, and it, it does the math for me and goes, okay, so you've done your summer foraging bundle. So you need one less grape, one less sweet pea, one less spice berry kind of thing, right? So we'll keep track of all that for me. Um, I'm still, I'm nearly done the proof of concept. I'm working on like my actual SQL queries now. Uh, my web page did work until recently. Um, I keep changing column titles and stuff. Um, gonna have a mode to upload a save file to extract what has been done. Or gonna have a mod. Um, I don't know. I, I'm literally teaching myself how to do this from scratch. Like I've, I have some experience with SQL. I have no experience with PHP. Um, I know HTML, I know CSS, whatever. So is it going to be a mod? I don't know, because like I guess it's going to be in a database. Like how would I, I mean, I could post like the source code of everything to GitHub in case somebody else wanted to set up a different database, save files, trade XML. That is true. That is true. But here's the thing. I also don't want to duplicate work. So, I mean, I have the predictor. I have, or the, I guess more importantly, in this case, the checkup. The checkup says what I've done, but it's not telling me that I still need three amaranth. Speaking of which, that should be green, uh, for example. So um, that's the kind of thing that I'm really trying to trying to track is how much do I need? And then how many do I have? Or, or how many more do I need, I guess? So yeah, the database is just going to make it a little bit easier to do it. And then where did my database go? It's over here. Um, so yeah, I basically kind of have things I'm using the Stardew, the actual Stardew item IDs um, when I'm making some of my own for things. So I'm also including like bundles and quests and that sort of thing in my, it's a bit of a faff, but basically because everything is an item in the game, um, it actually makes it, looks like I brought Blade to the right stream. Because everything in the game is an item, uh, you can, I, what I'm basically doing is saying, okay, on my list of items, I'm also going to include say a bundle and I'm going to consider my bundle to be basically a crafting recipe. So for the summer foraging bundle, to craft to craft it, I need a spice berry, a sweet pea, and whatever the other thing is that I can't remember. Um, a grape, no, yes, yes. So I'm treating it like that, and that's how I'm kind of assembling the logic and stuff. It's a bit of a thing, but hopefully it'll be, like I say, I'm working on my queries right now, and then maybe I'll post all my queries to like Pastebin or something in case somebody wants to make it a formal thing. I also don't have a way to track more than one game. I mean, I kind of do. The way I'm going to set it up in the end is I'm going to have each game have its own table in the database, but you still have to have a database. You still have to have access to all that stuff and whatever. Reusing actual studies makes things much easier. It really does. And I'm super lazy. So just being able to go to that Stardew IDs website and copy and paste everything. It's pretty sweet. Uh, all right, let's go to the river. That's where we were going to go in the first place. Why even bring it up? Why are we having this conversation? How dare you? Uh, and let's try and catch a walleye in the four hours I have left before I pass out. Fingers crossed. It is good luck, so hopefully hopefully it works out. Are you? How are you incorporating friendship into this? I'm not. Basically, if I can track it in the game, then I'm not worried about it. Easy Having easiest love gifts per villager would be awesome. Um, that is true. I'm not doing, doing that stuff. Cause like I say, I can track the friendship in game. So I'm not, um, I can't talk and fish at the same time. I'm not, uh, doing that. Like I say, this is purely just items I need for fishing, foraging, crafting, cooking, shipping, basically. My predictor has some of the actual content files loaded in and read. Yeah, I, that was something somebody else had mentioned that too when I mentioned I was doing this yesterday. Somebody else was like, oh yeah, you know, you can like load the save file. And I thought, got a walleye. Uh, and I thought, okay, yes, that would be excellent. But that's a whole other layer of complexity that I'm not prepared to bite off yet. I need to hurry and get it done before my attention span runs out. And, uh, and, uh, Sure, doing stages. Yeah, I, yeah, I need, I need to hurry and finish before my attention span runs out, and then I just I can't be bothered anymore. Um, MVP and all that. 
Okay, let's grab you. Oh, I have another ghost fish. All right, well, I'm going to do that. Uh, so I'm going to go to the community center. We're going to take the walleye, take the sand fish, take the ghost fish, finish those guys. In fact, is that everything in there? Is that everything in here? Yeah, we're going to get the glittering boulder removed. Um, can't do those. Can't do that. Can't do that. Oof. Baby. Getting close. Uh, so funny story. Since you guys are here and since you guys know who Tushi is, um, funny story about the first time I met Tushi. So I've met him a couple of times at TwitchCon. Um, I wonder if I could find... I mean, it would, it would probably be in one of his videos. I can't remember if I... I think I may have taken a clip of it or something on on his stream when I met him, but um, I should try and find that, see if he even remembers. But, uh, yeah, he was basically just... Thank you, Copper Fronts, for the 100 bits. Thank you very much. Ooh, Dish of the Sea. Ooh, done. Walleye. Bang. Glittering boulder. Glow ring! Sweet, been waiting for that. Uh, anyway, so yeah, he was walking around with a camera, as he does, and um, I just saw him with his camera, and it, this was like a number of years ago, so his, his um, IRL streaming setup was an actual camera with a laptop tethered to his phone <laughs> over that. This is before like, everybody and their dog had a streaming app. Um... So I just like was like walking him and saw a stream and just like interrupted him as he was walking around with you know him and Panga and Kylie and um, had no idea who he was, had absolutely no idea who he was, and uh, so you know I know I you know looked him up afterwards and I was just like holy cow this guy's like <laughs> this guy's like a big deal and I just have no idea who he is. I'm just, don't mind me. I'm just gonna interrupt. I'm just gonna hijack your stream for a second. Don't uh, don't mind me. So here's a perfect example. How many do I need ghost fish for anything? I don't think I do. Ghost fish. So ghost fish, nothing specifically ghost fish. No quests, no recipes, no bundles, no whatever. Great. Sell. Done with shads already. Need the clam for stuff. Bread is food. Dish of the sea is sweet. Uh, glow ring. Yeah, I'm gonna replace my small mega ring with a glow ring so I can see. Um. Yeah. Hi, Jack. Best commercial. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, and then the year after that, uh, I saw him at TwitchCon again and said hi and whatever. He was super nice and like super chill and stuff like that. I think he vaguely remembered me from the year before, but uh, but yeah. So that was the story of of. When I met Tushi, I don't, I would doubt he even remembers at this point. And then I found five dollars. So anyways, the point is that, um, my perfection run's going poorly. <laughs> I say all that to say, my perfection run could be going better, but I've managed to pull it out, um, oh, my chat disappeared again. I managed to, uh, time for the backup chat. I managed to pull out, uh, you know, I managed to pull out a win with the community center, which is awesome. So if I get lucky with the Mackie roll, great. And if I don't, then... Oh, well. Whatevs. Anyways, so um, what are you guys working on? Like, what new exciting starting things have you guys come up with lately? Enough about me. Tell me about you. I, I completely ignore what the luck was. I just looked at it and didn't even... In before step manipping for Mackie roll. <laughs> Ram hacks. Ram hacks. Auto grabber. Sweet. Wish I could afford those. Oh, more mail. Uh, fall fair. Not happening. Absolutely not happening. Any other crops done? No. Okay. Uh, we have a diamond. We're going to start keeping diamonds for gifts. My inventory is an absolute disaster. Why do I have a ghost fish in here? That's weird. Put that in there. Uh, I'm doing a Married on Spring 18 Year One challenge. Wow. Shane? But Is it Shane by any chance? Piano is doing a semi-casual min-max two-year challenge. Haley? Really? Okay, hold on.
All right, you have my you have my interest. I am I'm curious about that. Um, can I sell anything right now? I've got so much stuff. Okay, so food. Obviously food, but I'm not gonna take that with me to the desert. That can be here. Uh, food, food, food. Why not food? Not food. Where are my mushrooms? Not food. Food. Garbage. Lots of billboard quests. Going for 69 million primarily from sweet gem berries. 69 in two years? But from sweet gem berries, though. Interesting. That is interesting. 69 in two years. Nice. But from sweet gem berries, not from... You know, pigs or starfruit wine or whatever. Interesting. The menu sounds in this game makes me think Discord, Discord's going nuts. I found him a seed that has a boatloads of rare seeds in the cart. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Sorry, I keep pausing the game. <laughs> Sorry, Copper Friends. Xbox, turn off. Yes. All right, um, let's pet the animals. I do need more duck feathers. Replicating them six times each time I plant. Then abusing double harvest. Nice. Man, you guys are just too powerful, too powerful to leave alive. I'm just like, I'm just a person. Actually, I should make a duck mail thing. I'm just, I'm literally just some Yahoo who owns a computer and you guys are like, Changing, changing the star you game. Actually, it's interesting that you caught me on this night. I'm glad you guys stopped in. It was nice. It was great meeting you guys. Um, you guys that I've heard so much about and have seen in other people's streams. Um, because to be honest with you, normally I'm, I'm a, normally I'm a music streamer. I'm taking a break from a bunch of music streams to to do this Stardew challenge. So, Cordite uh, just got 5.6 thousand iridium in one day. <laughs> Heavens. Heavens to Betsy. 5,000 already in one day. I should be so lucky. Alright. Cheese, cheese. To be fair with the friendship stuff, I haven't been doing a lot of gifting. Um, I have not been. I've been, like, gifting some people. I'm kind of going to do it in stages. I mean, I'm still in year one, so I, I have time, right? Like... Year two is basically going to be... Year one, I'm kind of just, like, making sure I can do everything in terms of crafting, in terms of cooking, that sort of thing. And then year two, I'll basically kind of do a, a bit of a min-max in the sense of, like, making as much money as possible. Um, you know, making the money you need for everything and then um, doing a... Uh, doing the friendship stuff. Because by then I'll be able to, like, oh, this tree's done. <laughs> Didn't even notice that. Um, I'll be able to do the friendship stuff and whatever else. So, just wanted to grab those. Good try. Uh, grab those. Okay, apples. How many apples do I need? Apparently, I need six. I think these three are the last that I need for the six, if I'm not mistaken. But again, so I have six. Have I shipped one? No. Or let's ship one. I'm kind of tempted to go to the Skull Caverns today. To be honest, I'm a little tempted to do that. If for no other reason than to burn through some of this food I have in my inventory. Um, but it's going to be really embarrassing with Stardew Valley royalty in my chat. <laughs> Ugh. If you guys want to see the most painful Skull Cavern run ever. I mean, yeah, I can do that. This is what happens when bad video gamers try and play video games. Don't think I need the fiberglass rod. I'm just going to drop those in there. Um, uh, do I need anything else? Well, I should take something for... I could use the lucky lunch. I'm kind of holding off on the lucky lunch until 
Um, I get a good luck day, to be honest with you. I kind of want to do that. I kind of want to do lucky lunch and good luck and everything else. Spicy eel and stuff. Um, let me grab a flower for... What's her face? Sandy. So I've given the wizard two gifts this week, which is great. There's a lot less walking around. Uh, Sandy. How do I only have one heart with Sandy? Weak. Uh, alright. Mm -mm -mm -mm. If I don't go to the Skull Caverns today, what am I going to do? Where's my list of things to do? I need to check for a Mac Mackie roll. Uh, I should need to move the crab pots. I'm not doing that today. Uh, the other thing I could do is... What was I going to do? Upgrade the house. Right, what do, I need, what do I need to upgrade the house? To the wiki. Whoops. Wiki. Wiki, wiki. Um, 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 farmhouse. I need 10,000 gold, 450 wood. I really don't want to spend the 10 grand, but it would get me a Mackie roll. Ooh, I don't have the wood. All right, let's go cut down some trees. Actually, you know what I should do? Let me take these guys and that one. Screw the mahogany. Uh, and my axe. And we're going to go and clear the um, train station. Because I planted a bunch of trees up there, and most of them are probably done by now. <laughs> and my axe! And the horse that rode it on. I mean, one good thing, I mean, one thing I will say is this, it, in terms of Stardew Valley contributions in the history of Stardew Valley, is if I can do it, it friggin' anybody can do it. <laughs> Not everybody can do what you gentlemen do. Anybody can do what I do. So if I can do it, heavens. Heavens to Betsy. What up, Wooly? Talk to me about that. G give me that. Give me oh, give me my hat, though. And by hat, I mean pan. Uh, it's odd. I'm not sure what caused this boulder to disappear. Yeah, I, I, don't, I, I, don't, I don't... Like that when I got here. I don't know nothing about that. This stream is flowing from deep within the mountain. <gasps> Qu'est-ce que c'est? Hey, do you see that glistening in the water? Yeah, I'm hoping to get some luck rings from it on Ginger Island. <laughs> yes, that that's quality ore, but probably not much of it. The flow of water must be carrying it out of the mountain. You know what this means, right? Yes, I want the copper pan hat. It means we can start panning for ore. Okay, we were excited about different things. That's fine. Here, I've got an extra pan in my backpack. Why don't you take it? Okay. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, it didn't make the sound. If you ever see ore glistening in the water, use that pan and see what you find. Okay. Oh, there's the sound. There's the sound. You received a copper pan. At some point, I also want to... Boom! Pan hat, baby. There's copper in them there hills. There's an entire fronts of copper in them there hills. Alright, so I want to kind of little, kind of want to leave the oak trees if I can. But everything else can go. And it's super handy now that uh, the. Uh, okay, this is going to go poorly. I need to do this. Uh, super handy now that the tapper finish thing is on top of all the other sprites. That's also super handy. That I like. That makes me happy on the inside. That sparks joy. Let that do its thing. Oop, come on. Oh my goodness. Oh my word. Oh, go. Everything's bad. There we go. Uh, anyways. What else is going on that we can talk about? Not a lot. I tell you, I kind of went hard from uh, my big streams to into the Stardew stuff, like going straight up into like, oh, hey, you know what I should do? I should put my spreadsheet in a database. Here's the funny thing about the database thing that anyone who's programmed, I'm sure, will appreciate. 
So, it's not just a question of teaching myself PHP, teaching myself, or, you know, teach, well, I'll, I'll let me back up. It's not just a question of me teaching myself PHP and whatever. The funny thing about it is that, uh, so I'm like, okay, I want to set this up in a database. Great. So normally uh, you do it in the LAMP stack, obviously, you know, Linux, Apache, MySQL, PHP. I have a Linux box that I run. I have like a server over in the closet over there. Um, and the server, which I love very much, uh, does a bunch of things. And I'm like, okay, well, I could run it on the server. Um, but, upgrade house. Yes. Done. All right, there's a Mackie roll. Um, but, so I use DaVinci Resolve for my video editing. Uh, I believe Tushi does as well, actually. And what DaVinci Resolve has built in, in the free version of it, is it has, um, need to go fish. Oh crap, I forgot, I need to get, I need to be fishing up garbage. <sighs> let's go just, let's go fish. I love my fishing rod at home, crap. Um, so it has a, uh, the ability to use a Postgres database um, built into it for, for project files. So basically whether I'm editing on my desktop or on my laptop, I'm using the same project files, it's great. So I already had that server running, so I thought, well, I'm not gonna set up a MySQL database when I already have a database thing running. Let me just use Postgres instead of MySQL. Okay. Minor difference, I mean, SQL is generally the same. Few differences with the PHP commands, nothing major. But then I'm getting all that figured out because <laughs> when I set up the Postgres server, um, DaVinci Resolve kind of did it all for me. You just kind of said, here's a username, here's a password, knock yourself out, and it did, did, the, did, did the work for me. So that was kind of nice. So this time I had to figure out, okay, how do I put this stuff in here? And how does this all work? And how do I do the admin of it and whatever? So that was a bit of a thing. And then it was, um, okay, now I need a web server. Now, again, LAMP stack, you'd normally use Apache, but I'm like, okay, well, I don't really want to use Apache. Like Apache is like massive and, I mean, yes, it's popular or whatever else, but like, do I really need a web server that intense for, <laughs> for that? I really just need something super lightweight that just happens to run PHP. So I found one called Lighty that is uh, packaged with my distribution as well. So I'm like, okay, let me just use that. So now I'm like, that's different. So now when I'm looking for how do I do this, it's not like, okay, looking up a lamp stack, it's a little lip stack. So when I had that done, then it was, okay, so now how do I use PHP to access this Postgres database? First of, all, first of all, I had to get PHP running on the server, which wasn't too bad once I figured that out. And then, okay, once I've done that, how do I use PHP to access the database? How do I do that? So that was a whole thing. And then it was, okay, great. So I want to use checkboxes. Basically, I want to be able to hit a checkbox and have everything update automatically. How do I do that? How do I have this checkbox value update the database? And what am I doing for this ice pip that needs to chill out? Oh, my word. Um, so yeah, I figured out the connection. So like, yeah, how does I... So if, when I had this checkbox, how do I make sure this checkbox updates the correct field in the database? How do I do that? So like everything, every step along the way has been like, uh, okay, so how exactly... Here's what I'm trying to do. How do I do that? And then how do I do that in... PHP with a Postgres database, not a MySQL database and everything. It's been a gong show. So I, I kind of got got over the, the second to last major hurdle tonight. The only other thing I'm thinking about doing is in my spreadsheet, I kind of have things broken out by season. So I'm I probably what I want to do is have um, my little web page also break things out by season. So the question is, how do I flip between seasons? I need to flip between seasons. So I'm thinking about maybe like radio buttons and just like you hit a button, you go to the season, whatever. Because um, that hopefully won't be too bad. In fact, that's, that's, that actually might be pretty easy. So yeah, I need to, to basically, I have enough data in the database now to develop all of my SQL queries. Once that's done, 
then I can put the webpage together. <laughs> like I don't have enough hobbies. Off to bed, have a great stream. Thanks for stopping in, Piano Wag. Thanks, thank you very much for the raid. It's great to meet you. Thank you for the follow, all that stuff. I'll make sure I check out your stuff check out your stuff in more detail. Have a great night. For everything there is a season. Turn, turn, turn. I mean, true story. Uh, I need to eat some. Let me eat a ghost fish. Uh, question. How much uh, garbage do I have? Three. What? Okay, you know what? This ice pip can wait. I'm going to go to level 20 because I was catching way more garbage at level 20 the other day. How's my inventory? Could be better. That's okay. Let's see if we got some garbage here. <laughs> I clicked... My finger clicked before my brain heard the sound, so I'm glad that kind of worked out timing-wise. Floor 100 is lava eel or trim. If, <laughs> if I start catching lava eels... I'm going to be conflicted. All right. Come on, trash. Come on, trash. Yeah, yes. Blade. Now you're just saving my runs now. Holy cow. If going for trash, do short casts. Right. Of course. Don't need to cast. I get into the habit of casting as far as possible, so. Good point. Thank you for the reminder of that. Come on. More trash. <laughs> Dude, so glad you're here. Yike. Oh, my word. Anyways. Yeah. So this, the database thing's been taking up a lot of my brain power lately. I still have... Fortunately, I had songs, like, queued up for release. I have songs queued up for release for this month and for next month. And the song that I'm going to release in July is pretty much done, let's be honest. I'm probably not going to do much more work on it. After that, I have, I, have no, I have no major music plans, but at least I would have had, like, songs out nearly every month so far in 20, 2021. Hey, a lava eel. I'm not mad at losing that. That's fine. Could've just let it go, actually, but whatever. I might actually get this done today. You just saved my life. I should see... Maybe I'll eat the... I might just... You know what? I might just eat this ghost fish. Whatever. Well, I can eat him. Let's eat him. Get him out of my inventory. Now, how am I doing with this? Thirteen. Sweet. Foot. Fishing rod. If I hurry, I can actually throw him in the, uh... Thing tonight, too. What are you fishing for? A Kool-Aid? A Kool-Aid man? Oh, yeah! Um... I'm literally just trying to fish garbage. I have a quest that I need to do because you have to craft all the recipes to attain perfection, and so the recipe I need... I, I'll, get a, I'll get a recipe by completing this quest. So I just need to catch, like, a few more pieces of garbage and then throw them up by the train station, and then that will be the fiber seeds recipe. Which would be great. I gotta be close. Guess I probably shouldn't, shouldn't have had that lava fish. That's fine. Everything's fine. Nothing is not fine. Literally everything's fine. I must be close. Oh no! <laughs> oh yeah! There we go. Alright, to the train station. Every time. Alright, um... Oh, and I have a glow ring now. I can see it a little bit. I'm actually surprised I've gone this far and that's my first glow ring. Like, normally I've got glow rings for days. I don't have the combat to make a 
die. Oh, oh my word. Oh my goodness. There we go. 5, 10, 15. That crap. Oh, <laughs> uh, you can't get garbage from there, can you? Probably not. Bust through the courthouse wall. A little deep family guy deep cut. Okay. Come on. I'm going to try one cast. See if I get some garbage. <laughs> See, now it's making me mad that I'm catching fit. I'm just going to go back to level 100. I get paid to make music burst through walls. The Kool-Aid man came through. They create Sean Price. I don't. Uh, okay, so... Level 100. Can I just get one from here? Thank you. Oh my goodness. I don't know what happened to... I must have fished up... Oh, it's probably... Oh, what probably happened was I fished up garbage like yesterday. And then put it in my recycling bin because I had a piece of garbage and I thought I should put it in the recycler. Um... That's probably what happened. I'll bet you. All right. That's not the thing. I keep thinking that's... No, oh, there's a tree there, and there's a tree there. Let's put that in there. There we go. Got him. Okay, 12.20 at night. Let's head back to the crib. Um, I should probably make sure I have some seaweed. I'm pretty sure I don't, actually. <laughs> I need to make a macu roll, but I don't think I have any seaweed. How many seaweed do I need? One for I need six. Oh, maybe I do have seaweed. I remember, I seem to remember that number. Let's have a look. I probably have some seaweed somewhere. I hopefully have some seaweed somewhere. So tomorrow is Wednesday. What am I doing tomorrow in game? What do I have on me that I want to get rid of right now? Let's get drop off the sap. Let's drop off the sweet. I'll leave the sweet pea in here until I know I'm going to the desert. Which I mean, if tomorrow's a good luck day, I might go. But um, let me grab the this milk pail, and we'll leave that fiberglass uh, rod behind. And the axe we can leave behind as well. Uh, and the acorns. And the pine cones and the maple seeds. And the straw hat. Because I have my copper pan. And the hazelnut. The hazelnut needs to go somewhere. How many hazelnuts do I need? Fall. Hazelnut. Seven. I don't have seven. Uh, so the wood I will also leave in here, I believe. Sure. Um, unless I have wood somewhere else. Like, no, it's gifts. Okay. Uh, the wood can stay there. So we're talking about, talking about food. Food, 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 food. Uh, why not? Food, food. Uh, lots of food. That's food, that's food. That's food. Um. That's technically food. So let's drop the hazelnut in the house. We'll ship the pale ale. I know I need to ship a hazelnut. I really don't want to ship a hazelnut. Alright. Let's go to bed and see what luck we get tomorrow. Have I cut the dog today? <laughs> no, but I did bash the dog with my hammer today. Oh, actually, I have time. Let me put another hop in the... Uh, in right here. Another thing I need to do is make a lot of kegs. Bites, loses teeth, not not food. <laughs> it's like when I did my cooking stream, I was like, ooh, snack. Funny story about food. I Mainly because I'm not eating a lot of it right now. Alright, weather report. It's gonna rain tomorrow. Okay, lots of rain, which Best luck. Alright, well. Guess I'm going to the desert. Five receipts, thank you very much. Hard to do cookies wrong. Yeah, 
clearly you don't know me very well. Baked fish. Any buffs? Nope, that's food. Uh, let's sell the blackberry wine just because. So quickly, let's grab everything I need to take to the desert. So grab a warp totem. We're going to grab lucky lunch. Going to use that today. Uh, do I need anything else? Probably not. Okay. Let's just very quickly deal with the animals, and then we're going to go straight to the desert. Pet, pet the dog, too. Pet the duck. White chicken. Brown chicken. Uh, pig. Sir Moonington. Even though it's a, f it's a female. And the goat. And the goat. Okay. Uh... Oh my goodness, that's going badly. You go there, you go there. Uh, I'm just going to ignore the fruit cave while I will grab those blackberries, though. Bro made cookies in school, blame the teacher's recipe. So, I had a great chocolate chip cookie recipe that I used to make years ago. And I think probably the last time I made them, I had... I didn't... I'm, I was, like, really super careful about how I was spacing things out and whatever, and I thought, okay, well, I have, like, just a little bit of extra uh, dough. Um, I'm just going to try and space them a little bit closer together and um, space them together a little bit more closely, and, uh, and then I'll be able to fit them all on there. Uh, it was too close together, <laughs> and... Uh, I ended up with one massive uncooked <laughs> chocolate chip cookie. It was it was kind of hilarious and kind of heartbreaking at the same time. She made shortbread cookies in elementary school. Nice. I am a fan of the shortbread, not gonna lie. So I'm gonna go with Lucky Lunch and then we'll go with Spicy Eel. I'm gonna grab the coffee. I've got a lot of stuff on me for food, but that's okay. Because I'm gonna I'm bad at video games, I will burn through it. Did I bring a flower? Mother Muffin, I didn't bring a flower for What's-Her-Face. You know what, she can wait. Uh, let's grab... We're going to start with... A l the Lucky Lunch. And I'm also going to grab... Luna Cafe. Alright, we've got like... It's best luck and we've got plus three luck. I don't get all of the drop shafts in the world. I'm gonna be sad. I'm also gonna screenshot this whole day. I don't wanna mess around with uh, with not doing that. So no ladder. right now really just want a ladder or something drop shaft even better here we go now because I am particularly bad at video games I am going to make a point of um, getting whatever iridium I find oh my goodness that just wrecked my life Really? Do I do I even have the recipe for mega bombs or anything? I do. Hmm. Probably should have brought some essences with me. Okay, having a hard time switching back switching back and forth here. There's a ladder. Screenshot. I got a drop shaft early. That was that was nice. Uh, coffee cafe. Ladder. <laughs> was not paying attention there. Definitely want to screenshot this level. 
Um, nothing. Uh, all right. I also, of course, did not bring a lot of stone with me, so I can't just make a zillion ladders. Screenshot. Nothing. Although I am glad I got the big backpack recently. I need to eat so oh my goodness ah uh, yep. Let's eat the baked fish, shall we? Let's clear some inventory spots here. Yeah, definitely should have made a point of getting some more stone or something. Oh, there's seven levels. Nice. Uh, a little low on health. Let's eat an carp. And let's also eat uh, a sardine. And let's also... Let's eat this too, why not? Eat the ghost fish. Uh, let's also check for a ladder real quick, though. Should I move this over here? There we go. Uh, what do we have? We've got nothing. <laughs> okay. Ladder. Wait, is this a, sh a small level? My kingdom for a mega bomb. Ladder. Or a ladder. A ladder is also good. I see a ladder. Let's grab that iron while I'm here. Definitely using getting a screenshot on this one. Uh, nothing. A lot of gold there, though. That's kind of tempting. Um, can I make any bombs right now? I don't have any. I don't have it. Didn't bring any coal with me. That's embarrassing. All right, that's fine. I mean, it's still early days. Like, it's still I'm not gonna worry too much about ladder stuff. I'm just going to look around here real quick. Coffee. Well, I mean... I'm hoping that the best luck will also give me a smattering of iridium. <laughs> I can make an bomb of something, uh, this guy. While I'm here, actually, I think I'm also gonna grab this. And this gold. And hopefully a drop shot. I'll take the ladder. Nice. All right, so, ooh, this is a big level. Definitely want a screenshot. To be fair, most levels I want a screenshot. Uh, any open ladders or drop shafts? No. There's a ruby way down there, but hopefully I'll get a ladder before that happens. That's the wrong tool. I just, I just need, like... Well, I need one more bar of iridium... Um, to be able to have six iridium sprinklers in the greenhouse. That is, like, the battle cry right now. That's what I need the, mo we need the most. I just need, like, five er pieces of iridium ore. Like, pretty pleats with sugar on top. I need to eat something, too, actually. I should make sure I eat. Liking that nearly animal sound from the bomb. Um, let's eat the cactus fruit. Oh, I should eat the bread, too, actually. Let's eat some bread. Yeah, the sounds in this game are great. Stardew is such a great game. Just is such a good game. Coffee. 
Today is the day to use absolutely everything I've got. I'm not gonna be shy about using coffee, about using like spicy eel when it comes up. Like today is the day that it's best luck. I got to the skull caverns decently early. Not messing around today. Oof, this is can I make another bomb? Noise. Grab some of that stone so I can make some stairs too if I need to. How much stone do I have now? 146, okay. That's I don't even have a tool selected. Spicy eel in the coffee. I should check for a ladder. So I'm not wasting my time. Um, oh, there is no ladder, but there is an iridium node. I might go and blow that up with a bomb or something. Ah, forget it. Bomb. Actually, you know what? Can I make a cherry bomb? Oh, I don't have any copper. Sad. Oof. I hate to use the, uh... hate to use, uh, all my coal for that, but that's what I get for not bringing any coal. Oh, I got a coal there. Ladder. Ooh, what's this? Beet seeds. Radish seeds. Sweet. Check for oh, that's gone poorly. If I can hurry, ladder sweet, <laughs> get out of there before everybody shows up. Uh, okay, quick check of the level. Do we have a ladder or anything? Got a little bit of iridium. I kind of really don't want to not grab it because grammar. Ah, uh, coffee. also kind of want to grab. Okay, so we have a ladder there. I, I want to get the iridium, though, like, honestly. Oh, that's, 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 a, that's a crab. Ooh, we got crab cakes, though. Shouldn't have done that. Whoops. Okay, time to eat. Um, let's have one of those. buttons, right? Ooh, got a bomb from that, sweet. There we go. How much do I have? I can't, okay, so I have enough for my sixth uh, sprinkler. That's a load off the oh crap. That is indeed a load off of the oh crap. Okay. I need to eat something again. Because my health is super low. Quick look around for some... Oh, 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 my word. Oh, everything is bad. Literally, oh, everything is so bad. Oh, now this guy's coming for... Oh, my goodness, I gotta get... I gotta get aggressive here. Uh, yeah, you know what? Uh, I think now is as good a time as any to use some stone. Okay. Uh, ladder? Ladder check? Nothing. Okay. Still early, though. I still have lots of time. I should, I should actually bomb this. Let me, like, bomb somewhere in the middle or something. Alright, so my coffee just ran out. Let me have another cup that caffeine addiction. I need this guy to like fall over somewhere where I can run. 
Oh, that wasn't far enough away. That's okay. We still got a little bit of stuff. I'm going to have another of these. That almost went badly. There we go. I'm going to grab this ruby, because that's going to be useful for more spicy heal. I uh, don't see any ladders anywhere. So I think the next thing after this is I need um, five bars of iridium ore to fix the boat to Ginger Island. That's the next thing I'm trying to... That's the next thing I'm going for. Purple mushroom? That could be good food. And a bit of iridium down there. Maybe I'll go grab that. Grab the purple mushroom. Run! Mm. Is that a crab? Oh, it looks pretty good, actually. It might be okay. Yoink. Maybe I'll grab that one here. Alright. <clears throat> How much more time do I have on my two minutes? Okay. So, I mean, I'm only at level 37. Um, and my luck is about to run out. I'll switch over to a spicy. Yes, yeah, so we got a spicy eel. Sweet. Ooh, crit. Get over here. There we go. I'll check for a ladder from there. Should have got that rock hard by the ladder too. All right, screenshot. I mean, like I say, it is, is this still best luck? And it is still... I still have plus three luck. Like, I mean... It, nothing. Should I get that coal, though? How am I doing for coal? Ah, I probably shouldn't. Honestly, I don't... I'm not going for coal right now. I'm going for iridium, so I probably... Stay away from the baddies. Ladder. Sweet. There we go. Problem solved. Ah, uh, this is definitely a bomb. Um, could probably even use a cherry bomb, actually. But you know what? If I'm gonna use a piece of coal anyways, let's go for broke. Okay, that kind of didn't work super well. And now I'm not dead. Okay, bad things are happening. Yeah, bad things are... Oh, drop, trap, drop, trap, drop, trap. Seven levels. I'll take it. Okay, food. Uh, what should I eat next? Purple mushroom? Yeah. Good thing I picked that up. Oh, I should have a coffee as well. I'm trying to, like, hold off on coffee a little bit, but at the same time, I really shouldn't. I do need more frozen tears, so I'll grab that while I'm here. I do want more iridium. Grab that while I'm here. Jade. A jade would be very good. Um, I might draw this guy over a little bit and then make La Bomba. Come on over. There we go. Thank you. Bomb that. Nothing. Except the solar essence, which I can't be mad at. There we go. At least my drop shafts are really good. Like, I'm not getting, like, uh, you fell three levels. Like, everything's been pretty sweet in the drop shaft department. Probably should have checked for a ladder already. How much sheridum do I have? 24. 
how much do I need? Uh, I needed, well, I'll, ideally, I would need enough for six bars, so 30. I'm actually really close. I might get the 30 that I need, because I need, because I'm pretty sure I have four bars at home. One more, or five. Wait, <laughs> can't remember. Okay, there's a ladder right there. I do, again, I want the iridium, so I'm not going to mess around not getting iridium. Oh, my luck is a just ran out. Rip. Well, thank you, Lucky Lunch, for for helping me out today. Shout out to Lucky Lunch that I was able to buy from... Shout out to Gus for having a Lucky Lunch available for me. Now I've got super speed. Oh, wait, I've got a ladder up top already. Going so fast, my magnet ring can't keep up. Okay, well, I do want to get some stuff. I might have to start doing the whole pause strat. Make sure I don't miss anything and don't don't waste any time. Uh, we have no ladders, but I am going to go around counterclockwise so I can avoid that serpent if possible. Because the slimes I can just outrun. As I, as I get hit by a slime. As I get hit by a slime again. Thank God for the knockback on these things. Actually, that's a... Yep. Okay. We have 30, so I have enough for six. If I got enough for one more... Um, that would be, sh that would absolutely 100% be, hopefully, uh, be enough for, um, both the Radium Sprinklers and the both the Ginger Island when that becomes a thing. Uh, okay, what am I eating next? I guess I could eat, what do I have the least of? <laughs> so I went and bought, I went and spent two grand on salads and I haven't touched them. So I guess I'm eating salads now. I should probably eat the algae, though, to be honest with you. Let's get this algae out of my inventory. Let's do that. Uh, okay, so inventory check. Or, I mean, not inventory. Uh, ladder check. Um, none, but we do have some iridium. I just gotta watch out for that iridium bat right there. And I definitely want... Get over here, bat. That, oh my goodness, that thing nearly killed me. Just like in real life. Exactly. Stardew is nothing if not a completely realistic life simulator. Why do people even play The Sims? Just play Stardew Valley. Eating green algae fresh, ca caught fresh out of the water. I buy twenty dollars of salad from the store, then I eat Slim Jim's candy for dinner. <laughs> Is this just fantasy? Um, I had a salad recently, so in my attempt to eat a bit better, to eat a bit less meat and a bit more veggies and whatever, I did um, eat a salad recently, uh, fairly recently, anyways. Um, this bat getting dangerously close. Um. Yeah. The big problem for me is obviously um, just feeling hungry all the time. <laughs> because I do. Um, and still wanting to like... And still... Oh my goodness. Die, bat. And still wanting to like have sugar and dessert and stuff. And I do. So I have to like eat a small... I literally just ate how many freaking green algaes to get my energy up, and then one hit, and this bat is wrecking my wrecking shop. <laughs> Thank you. Got caught in the landslide. Um, so I just, yeah, I just kind of feel hungry all the time. That's just, it's just my life. All right, I am absolutely going to splash out on a mega bomb for this level. Oh my goodness, I'm just, everything is hurting. 
Um, white algae. There's a little, I'm gonna let that thing blow up so it's not sitting there hissing at me the for the rest of the night. I do need to get some energy before I go into that drop shaft. I don't think you can die from the fall, but if past experience is anything to go on, there'll be a bad like I'll be at like one health and then try to eat something, mess it up, not eat something, have a serpent fly or a bat come at me and kill me and whatever, it'll be a whole thing. And I do not plan on dying this evening. What do we say to the god of death? We say, can you can you come back on Thursday when I'm not playing Stardew? Okay, well, you know what? I mean, honestly, in terms of um, Stardew Valley, in terms of people who play the game well, in terms of the person Blade was talking about earlier, who got 5,000 gold and, uh, or 5,000 iridium in one run. This run's been awful, but in terms of me, this has been very successful because I got all the iridium that I need uh, to do the, the things I need to do next. So, because I think with iridium bars, what I'm doing is sprinklers, boat, Pickaxe, I think is what I'm doing. Uh, I don't want to see one thing of Iridium, so I'm not going to go for it. Drop shaft. Ball damage, what's that? Well, when you're clumsy like I am. Oh. My. Word. I want to kill the Pepper Rexes. Um. How many Pepper Rexes do I need to kill? Because you don't need to kill that many in general, so like the more... The more you can kill, the better. Uh, what is it? It's... Monster hunting. Show details. Pepper X is 43. Good lord. Um, oh my goodness. That was a mistake. Uh, I'm going to make a staircase, and we're going to stare the heck out of here. I'm just not feeling... I'm not feeling this right now. Okay, so it is midnight. Do I want to get this iridium in the furnaces tonight? I don't need to, actually. Because I'm not going to need it until... for. I'm not going to need it for a few days, so... Do I really want to pass out in the mines? Not really. Am I going to pass out in the mines? Uh, possibly. Thank you. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I don't see any point. How much more iridium am I gonna am I gonna get? I'll try and make it home. Be helpful if I got a ladder. Let's just go. I'm, not, I'm actually not sure if I'm gonna make it home now. Let's find out. All right. Well, you know we got 60 iridium. That's good enough for eight bars. No, that's not good enough for eight bars. That's good enough for like 12 bars. Bam. That's fantastic. Played a number of games that include it. What time is it? I'm tempted to go put it, but I'm not going to. I am tempted to, to go to the mines and throw in the iridium. I might have time with my speed and stuff. I might have had time, but that's okay. Let me not push my luck. We're going to call it a night here pretty quick. Let me just get home. Anything I want to sell? Could have left some stuff behind. Could have left the ruby. Could have left the jade. Uh, the bug meat I want to turn into bait, actually. Uh, I might sell the fiddlehead. And the white algae. And I think, I think I'm keeping pretty much everything else. I don't really need the radish seeds. I'm pretty sure I have all the radishes I need. They're summer crop. Do I have all the radishes that I need? Yeah, I'm just going to sell the radish seeds, I think. Uh, so let's just quickly deal with some inventory. Grab the milk pail for tomorrow. Uh, let me just put my bait on there. 
Um, that goes there. Uh, that those go there. That goes there. That goes there. That goes there. That goes there. Um, yeah. And then over here, I should start gifting Emily, actually. That's what I should really do. Frozen tear goes somewhere else. Anything else for the gifts? Emeralds? Probably emeralds, I guess, could be a gift. Uh, I need... That could go there, that can go there. Bunch of ore to process. The quartz I want to throw in a furnace. Where is my... There they go. Bone fragments. Um, and I think we're pretty good. Yeah, I think we're pretty good. That'll do for tomorrow. What up, dog? Got the dog already. All right, well, that was... I just check, double check the queen of sauce, just for paranoia's sake. Sweet. All right, well, that... <laughs> And I got the crystallarium recipe. Ooh, that's the next thing I need, actually. Maybe I should... Hmm. Do I save the iridium to upgrade tools? Or do I make more crystallariums? I do need the crystallariums. Actually, kind of badly, because I really need to start gifting... Um, Maru, if I'm going to marry her. So, we need, so tomorrow... Let's just check everything out. Good luck today. Let the dog just because I have to. I'm gonna I'm gonna reset this day. Let's just check and see what we have going on for tomorrow. So we've got the eggplant. We've got whatever that is. Yams. Ain't too hard for me to yam. We've got some more corn. Um do we happen to have a duck feather today? That'd be exciting. Nope. Uh do we happen to have anything in the fruit cave? Nope. Um Okay, so one, one of the things I definitely want to do next day in game, which is going to be summer 12, or fall 12, rather. Fall 12. Is uh, we don't need to check Gus for a Mackie roll anymore. We already upgraded the house. Uh, we need to make uh, uh, or smelt the iridium. Um, crops are ready. Plants more pumpkins. Um, I guess I could check the farm to see if there's any exciting forageables. I don't think it's going to matter too much, really. Like, really, the push right now is to get the the community center done, and I will have it done. Um, the only thing I'm missing... So I just need a pumpkin, which will be done, I guess, tomorrow. Hopefully I get lucky with my winter seeds, get a, a snow yam. Uh, the pomegranate. The pomegranate is an issue. The pomegranate is definitely an issue. But that's... Uh, th we're super close, though. Cause I, because this... Yeah, you know what? I just... I have the pomegranate tree planted. Unless I can get one from the traveling cart. No, I can't. Um, so yeah, I'm going to have to wait for the pomegranate tree to grow. So that was one... Slight-ish. Slight oversight there. Um, so yeah, we'll smelt the iridium. We'll harvest the crops. Um... And then, yeah, we'll, I mean, what was the luck again? I forgot what the luck was already. I guess I could probably make some more tappers and stuff, start prepping for kegs. Uh, the luck is good luck. So I could potentially think about doing a, a um, another um, skull cavern run. Skull cavern? Question mark? Question mark? Um, if not, get more tappers. Um, so we can get some more oak resin for kegs that we're the kegs that we're gonna need for year two. Well, actually, the kegs that we're gonna need for the last half of winter, because hopefully by the middle of winter I'll have my first batch of star fruit. If I can get to Ginger Island super early. If I can get to Ginger Island before winter one, which should be possible, um, with the, if, you know, with, you know, R and Jesus blessing me, um, then I should get my first batch of star fruit halfway through winter. So I could probably keg that. Um, I suppose if I'm doing that, I could move the crab pots at long last. I still need a bunch of stuff for recipes and things. And let's just check the traveling cart for the 12th. Make sure I don't miss anything. 
garlic, tulip, wood fence, cave, carrots, hard fungus, I'm going to brown eggs, fancy, nothing I want there. Uh, cranberry, tulip, summer, 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 battery pack, trap bobber, wood fence, nothing there, nothing there. So yeah, we're doing pretty good today, it was great. <laughs> so many great things happened. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, I'm going to call it a night. Uh, before I go, let me say thank huge old thanks to Variant for the bits and the Copper Fronts for the bits as well. Thank you to um, uh, Fear of the Deer, Bard Tape, The Great Blade, and the incomparable Piano Addict for the follows, and Piano Addicts as well for bringing everybody in for the raid. Thank you very much. Um, I'll be back tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m. Pacific Time. We're going to wrap up my streaming week with more Stardew. And we're going to keep playing Stardew probably non-stop, to be honest with you, until I finish this challenge. Um, but yeah, I'm going to say goodbye to YouTube, and then we'll wrap up the stream. So bye to YouTube, and now we're going to wrap up the stream.